We sparred here back when we were young. Jasper, show yourself. Say those the monsters take before they finish their business in this life. Come back as bitter black spirits. Looks like that's what we're dealing with here. It's Jasper like as not. Why? Why did this happen to me? I'm sensing a horrible, ugly hatred. Careful, everyone! I don't usually make it my business to fight vengeful spirits, but something tells me we don't have much choice. Let's do this. This is not your fight. I must face him alone. Hendrik, that's not the man you knew. It's nothing more than the darkness he left behind him. A darkness I helped create. A darkness I must destroy. Alone. Let us bring this to an end. Come, Jasper! It is time at last. Jasper, I must put an end to your suffering, once and for all. Scrap ah! metal! Jasper, I must put an end to your suffering, once and for all. Cower world! Please, don't. <laughs> so this is the power of the darkness. <laughs> How can this be?
<laughs> Forward! <laughs> Jasper, can you hear me? When was it that our paths diverged? Were we truly once allies? Ah! <sighs> My voice no longer reaches him. If I am partially to blame for your pain, then it is also my duty to end it. Hang! Drink! <laughs> Jasper, forgive me. Your pain ends now. Again you surpass me. Again you outdo me. Again you... You leave me behind. The more you bathed in glory, the more brightly you shone, the more I receded into shadow. Do you know what it was that I always wanted? I wanted to be like you. Jasper, you speak of surpassing me, but in truth it was I who always followed in your wake. I was robbed of my home, my family. I was alone. You were the one who spurred me on in their place, the light that guided me. <laughs> <laughs> you are the same sentimental fool as ever, I see. You do remember that I betrayed you? How could I forget? I am indeed a fool. But not for that. For not seeing before it was too late. If I had spoken to you, if I had listened, perhaps I could have saved you. You knew. You always knew. We were born two very different souls. It was that difference that brought us together. As your light grew brighter, mine could only blacken in response. And before I knew it, I felt more kinship with the denizens of the dark you battled so righteously than I did with my own kind. The lure of evil grew, and before I knew it, I had passed the point of no return. I saw then what Mordigan saw, the beauty in the blackness. Shed no tears for me. I seek no sympathy. All I ask is that you answer one question. Do you still... Do you still consider me your comrade and companion? Always. 
friend. How long I have waited to hear those words. Do you remember the pact we made as boys? Come. It is time we made good on our promise. The two-headed eagle cannot fly with just one wing. From this day forth, my spirit shall stand alongside yours. We will never be apart again. <laughs> oh. That's one heck of a suit of armor. But then those two always were quite the combination. <sighs> Forgive my self-indulgence. But know that I have not forgotten my pledge. I shall be... No. We shall be your sword, your shield, your unswerving companions. My oldest friend and I together. Though it was long in coming, far too long. We are united at last. <laughs>